Douglas group. These sure don't look like normal rovies to me. I think this is where the elves that run the mining operation live. If I want to get to the mines, I gotta get around to the other side. Hello everybody, I'm Copycat and we are back for more sticks and I think we just went full Starcraft with these uh, exploding little creatures. So, that's a bit of a problem. And we keep encountering lots and lots of new enemies in this, uh, in this level. So, we are trying to go where the ugly face is because there is some pure quartz over there. That's our mission, what we are here to steal. But let's see, we first need to go through that. And I hope they are still blind, not sure. But I can drop on that mouse over there, it would not make any sound. Again, against the robbies, we need to be extra stealthy. Really slow, take it easy. So, that's what I'm doing. Because otherwise they will instantly sleep in me. So here we are going. So I guess I can go up there. And the elf, of course, of course they are. So let's stay in the shadows, pick up a few items. Where is that guard? Over there? Oh, this one is not, not sleeping. So, careful. Can I go up? Yes, I can. Right now? Hmm, probably not. But I will go into that tower to see if there are some uh, stuff to get. If it's only craft and skills, it's not a lot useful, but still, it's better than nothing. And I don't need to craft anything right now. Not really using my ember, so I don't care. I will probably get a vial or two on the way. No need to waste resources on that. But now I can stick to the ledge, avoid the ground, and move on. I guess we are going in that room. Can I, should, should I go up there? That's a good question. But I don't think I need to. Whoa. Don't rush through the window. So it's just a goblin away. Nothing important. This is where the degenerates who work down here live. You'd have to be crazy to want to live here. I wonder how Lysrum is paying them. So we did not like the torch when the torch went out. Let's use this opportunity to go through. Maybe. I don't know what his friend is doing on the right. Okay, that's good. That's good. But I may need to hide. So let's make sure. Says the pearl quartz. You can go up there with the rope. And I think that's what I'm going to do. Let's just wait for this guy to move. Or this girl, should I say.
any second now. Come on. And he's watching the rope now, so <laughs> let's wait a bit more. Please stop. Or maybe he's just watching the, the torch. Let's see. I think I can't click. Yeah, he's not watching. I think we are still going up with the ropes, so let's go that way. Just need to get onto the... Oh, I should have got up the rope all the way up. Let me get back on this. And yes, sneaky, sneaky. You will see me. They may hurt me. And I failed my jumpy. Or something like that. I'm getting close to the cabins. Nothing. Hmm. Oh, she was sleeping, so I woke up her, woke her up. Did not need to throw that sand. So again, it's better to stay on upper level. It's safer. So I could go grab the more sand over there. Just when I needed a tunnel. Oh. There is a tunnel on the left. Good. I could go with the rope on the right. Sand it. Well, yeah, I think it's the it's the way to go. Anything up there? I don't think so. I might need to distract them. Or maybe not. Uh, yep. You are one big mother of a cockroach. Hey, is that quartz around your neck? An ancient little detail that son of a troll job I forgot to mention. Well, I'm not going back empty handed. I need that quartz. I may not be a god of war, but I'll find a way to get it. Guess it's go time. I must remember to thank Jara for this charming. Weekend excursion. So I did not expect to go face to face with um, uh, what's his name again? I forgot. But it's a big monster they used for the sacrifice, and now this is troublesome because the quartz is growing on him. So let's just try a way to get this out of his neck. And man, this is gonna be harder. Way harder. I'm sorry, what? Damn it. So I triggered an alarm. That's bad. But they can go past the gate. Nobody's here? No. Okay, fine. I'm 
food and health. I could craft more, but I don't need to. Anything up there? Hmm. Looks like a path, but... No. It's nothing. Nope, no secret here. So we need to go down. Let's do that. Stop exploring. Let's just move on. Still no enemies here. So that's good. And I mean with a big ass uh, lizard. I could understand why nobody is there. Because he kill anything that gets in his way. visited us. His bodyguard got too close. She ran him through. I'll never forget it. We found the body, or at least what was left of it when she was done. In any case, no need to worry for Lakima. Lakima. That's our name. Closer. Oh. I thought he was blind. I did not think it was making sounds to extinct the torch. My bad. So now we have a, a combination of both elf and roach. Or rubies, I think it's the name they use. So we need to be extra stealthy and stay hidden. It's getting harder. This is bad, but they are not noticing me. So that's good. That was like the worst place to go. And this is not better. Oh man. It's poor decision time, yay! So let's see, I need to get away from this room fast. Any place to hide, any place to go? No. Big as fort, don't need that. Please not the wasp. <laughs> okay, so you are not in the room. But I could go up there. Good. Now I feel safer. Let's quick save. And let's see. Yep. This is all really bad. But I guess we need to go down to get inside the lair. So let's check over there. Okay, these are not joking with the torches. And, uh, how can you see me? I was not in the light. Oh, sneaky way. Nope, we are not safe yet. But anyway, I'm I'm getting a break here. So I think we are safe on this spot. 
But yeah, it's really getting harder now. The combination of those uh, two enemies, it's not making it easy for me. So let's see where we can go with this. Uh, if we can keep progressing. I think we are on a good path. But anyway, I'm going to leave you here for now. And I hope you will have a nice day. And I see you later. Bye.